Hey YouTube, uh, YouTubers, welcome to back. It's really hot today. Our air conditioner ain't keeping up, so I got well one of the window units from the over there from the yard shed over there. The sun is like set on 60 seconds. It's on cool, but the compressor should have kicked on already. This is a Frigidaire. They're just warnings, yeah. Been sitting here for about five minutes. Compressor's not kicking on. Hit the test button. Then I get it to where you can see the temperature. I may end up having to go get another one. Yeah, it's bad. Wish I could just take the generator over there, but kind of may have to. But then, like you said, if I get the generator run, it's going to get started anyway. As we have an event this week weekend starts today the fair in Fredericksburg Virginia it starts today but I'm aware me and the wife are on call today probably for probably for the whole event and so oh shoot Well, I got another window unit. It should be good, but that's in PA. Dang, and it's a Xena. It's out of, I don't know if you've seen my previous videos from years and years and years and years and years and years, and years ago. But it's a Xena. It was in my camper. I didn't start doing videos until I moved to PA, but I've done some videos in my childhood neighborhood, childhood home. So, yeah, it looks like this frigid air is no good. So, it's not going back to the shed, so there's no sense of keeping it. There's something in there that's out of. It's low on Freon, because it's not going to kick on if it's low on Freon. Then you'll burn out the compressor, or the compressor might be already blown out. Hey, the last time they were used was April last year, so it's been over a year now. There's that sticker. Y'all want to see it. Yeah. She. She. I think she just kicked on. Yep. She just kicked on. Dad might end up getting ours. 
been sitting here for about 10 minutes and it just kicked on. Or the one from the kitchen living room. That's bigger. That's what I said. Well, I thought the one in Dad's room. No, this is the one from Dad's bedroom. The one that was in the living room over there, it, it, it works, but it, you got to fiddle. Plus, it don't kick off. Well, it did at night. It's as cold as it's going to probably get. Ah, there we go. Now it's just been out cold air. And no, still when I was storing these, they were stored like this. There's reasons being, is because it's like the freezer, it's like refrigerator. If you store them like you know, tipped up, tipped back, or not, they're normal. Like this is how it's supposed to be. Now, if you don't do it that way. Then you have to let it sit for 24 hours and let the refrigerant go back to the bottom of the it, it's container. That way you can run it, because if not, you'll burn it up. I've never burned one up, but I've always been told that. And unfortunately, I'm not willing to risk uh, something that I know is good just because I want to run it right away. So that's why when I store an air conditioner unit or refrigerators or freezers, I don't, you know, I keep them upright. Um, like if you're going to transport a refrigerator or a freezer to, from one location to another, don't tip it over. Because if you do, you have to let it sit. So if you can have it upright, leave it upright. I mean, you could tip it, you know, like on a dollar like that for a short period of time, but don't like, don't store it like hours and hours and days and days and then expect to, to plug it in and use it. So, well, it looks like this one's going to work. And I hope this is the one that he said to get. Now all of them, including the one... And you'll see over there at the other trailer where you got the two windows. We had a, the big unit was on that side. It's flaky shaky too. So this one's actually the best one out of the three. So we'll include this in this video here. Thank you for watching. If you have a comment, please leave one. Subscribe and like. Um, try to stay cool and drink plenty of fluids. Thanks for watching.